What's going on YouTube? It's your boy Juan TV and I am back with another video. And before we get to today's video, make sure you like this video, follow your boy on IG, and make sure you most importantly subscribe to the channel. You feel me? Alright y'all, so today's video is going to be on how to style on these shoes right here, the Air Jordan 4 Crimson, Red Thunder, whatever y'all want to call them. These right here, you know what I'm saying? It's been real slow to start the year, you know what I'm saying? Ain't really been that many shoes dropping, just these and the Court Purple 13s that nobody cared about. So yeah, I'm gonna do a hot style on these Red Thunders, you know what I'm saying? I really like this shoe. Like, this is a shoe that I actually really, really like. Most people are liking it right now because it's a hot shoe and you can get, you know, value for it as far as resale. But me, personally, I actually like, like the shoe. Like, I wore them and everything already, you know what I'm saying? But yeah, this right here, and on the red thunder, we're gonna do a how to style on these. Alright, y'all, so the first fit up is more of a casual type of you know every day going out type of fit you know what i'm saying you hang out with the bros you know what i'm saying or like a mall trip type of fit you know what i'm saying so first off we have these olive cargoes you know what i'm saying these bodies is busting a real deep dark olive these are from fashion nova man you feel me you know what i'm saying these are the regular cargoes no cuff bottoms no whatchamacallit snap bottoms none of that just some regular slim fit, kind of relaxed fit cargo. If you watch my channel consistently, you know I have these pants in three colors. So you know I really like these. But yeah, these are tough, these are hard, and these will be used on the bottom. For the top, we're gonna be using this Essentials Cream color t-shirt, you know, or buttercream, whatever it's called, you know what I'm saying? This is from the fall winter 2021 drop, I believe. No, this wasn't fall winter, this was spring summer. It has the Essentials Fear of God on the back right here, all big and bold with the Essentials rubber tab on the back. Playing the front, you know what I'm saying? It's just a dope Fati oversized. Y'all know how Fear of God Essentials is, you feel me? And I'm gonna say it again, I'm gonna say it every video. I mentioned Fear of God Essentials, I do wear extra small. I normally wear a small, but in Essentials, I wear extra small. For the next piece, we are using this bright red puffer jacket. You know what I'm saying? It's nice and thick, you know what I'm saying? You got that all that padding and whatnot all up in there. You know what I'm saying? And it's just a puffer jacket, you know what I'm saying? This is from Old Navy. Like I told you in my last How to Style video, y'all gotta hit up Old Navy for the outerwear. I'm telling y'all, puffer jackets, you know what I'm saying? Worker jackets, denim jackets, all that. Hit up Old Navy, I'm telling you. I'm telling you, you know what I'm saying? You'll save a lot of money, and it actually is good quality stuff. But yeah. This right here is a five jacket. The red goes perfectly with the uh, the red thunders, and I think it's just a five look to go with the outfit. All right, y'all. So the last piece is this trucker hat from Lost Love NYC. I do believe I leave it in my last video. I think I'm not sure, but yeah, you have a black trucker hat with the LA with the hearts up there. Like I said, I like Lost Love NYC trucker hats. They just fit nice. You know what I'm saying? And it's just a cool piece to have to add to the fit. All right, y'all. That's the first outfit. We're gonna hop right into it. Alright y'all, so the next fit is more of a chill vibe type shit, you know what I'm saying? So we got these sweatpants that I caught from ASOS, I actually have no idea what they're called, but you have like this yellow print right here on the left leg. On the right leg, you have a whole, like, scripture type junk, you know what I'm saying? If y'all want to pause that and read that, be my guess. But yeah, these are fire, you know what I'm saying? I just like how these look, you know what I'm saying? I did cut them on the outside to give them that baggier look, you know what I'm saying? Because I didn't like how they looked while they were scrunched together, so I cut it to give it a better look. And yeah, these is right here, these is fire. The next piece up is a hoodie, just a, a fire hoodie. Like, this hoodie just pops, you know what I'm saying? And this hoodie I actually got from Paxson. You know what I'm saying? It says Self Care Club, Los Angeles, California. You got all the different dope graphics. You got the pink and green flames. You got a smiley face with the, the flower right there. You got some more stuff on each sleeve. You know what I'm saying? Paxson, you make some five 
hoodies, bro. Like, this hoodie is fire, bro. Like, you would think this came from, like, like, uh, off-white or V-Lone or something. Like, this this joint is hard, bro. This joint is stupid hard. And this is fire. It's joint heavy, too, for real. It's good quality. But, yeah. And then for the hat, we're going to be using this Scattered Scents Snapback. You know what I'm saying? You have the World Series 1997 patch with their logo on it. You have their logo on the front. And then you also have Scattered Scents in the back. And this is just a dope hat. Like, I, I love this hat. The hat is fire. I wear this hat almost all the time. Like, this is a dope hat. You know what I'm saying? You don't see nobody with it. And Scattered Scents is more of a low-key brand. So, it's like, you're not really going to see a lot of people wearing this specific hat. All right, y'all. This is the second outfit. We're going to hop right into it. Alright y'all, so for the last and final outfit, we have this, you know, just a very versatile outfit. I feel like you can use this outfit for many type of different events. And yeah, so we got these baggy patchwork pants that I got from Forever 21, you dig? And they just probably got the patches right here on the right leg, as well on the left leg. These do have like the frayed hem at the bottom to give you that kind of vintage feel. I think I cut these. Yeah, I did actually slit these on the inside seam just to kind of get wider to kind of fit over the shoe better. And yeah, this is just a five, some five pants. You got the light wash denim with the dark wash and the lighter wash on the patches. It is a dope look, a very dope look. You know what I'm saying? This is one of the better pieces that fa not Fashion Nova, that Forever 21 has brought out. You know what I'm saying? And it's just, it's just cool. You know what I'm saying? It's just a cool vibe with these pants. For the top piece, we have this eccentric apparel hoodie. It says eccentric apparel on the front and then upside down it says uncommon fashion. You do have the Chanel patch EA for eccentric apparel on the hood. And then you have more on the back. It says keep living life and grinding for greatness. You know what I'm saying? The hoodie is dope, but the hoodie is hard. You know what I'm saying? This is tough. It's tough. Like, I really like this hoodie. It's just, it's a vibe. You know what I'm saying? Me, personally, I love black and red clothes. You know what I'm saying? That's just what I gravitate to when I'm buying stuff and wearing stuff. But it's just a fire, though, put it. And the back is puff print. It's fire. It's fire. And then over that, we are going to be wearing this brown vest. You know what I'm saying? Like a brown tan type of color. You know what I'm Kind of like a peanut butter. You know what I mean? And this is from... J. Crew, shout out to my mama. You know what I'm saying? She know I've been looking for a vest and my birthday just passed, so she bought me this for my birthday. You know what I'm saying? So yeah, this right here is fire, you know what I'm saying? It's kind of thin, but it's it's a layering piece for me. I don't really use vests for warmth. You know what I'm saying? I don't think nobody does for real for real. So yeah, this right here is gonna be a dope look to go with the outfit just to kind of put a different pop of color in the outfit. And then the last piece is the hat. We have this pistons kind of grid pattern hat you have the pistons with the old school logo up there you know what i'm saying you got a patch right there and then you have the nba patch on the other side you got the red the turquoise the black the hat is just hard the hat goes stupid bro the hat is crazy like this hat is fire all right y'all that's the last and final outfit we're gonna hop right into it <laughs> y'all that's how i would style the air jordan 4 red thunder tell me what you think about them and also tell me what you think about this shoe you know what i'm saying like it's a lot of different opinions about this shoe but it is what it is however personally my favorite outfit was the last one with the vest you know what i'm saying that outfit was fire fire you know what i'm saying like it is what it is i mean the rest of them was fire too but that one is like something like i would actually wear like y'all might see that on my instagram and like a couple weeks or so you know what i'm saying so yeah then let me know what y'all feel about these outfits let me know how you feel about the actual red thunder shoes themselves you dig if you like this video make sure you like comment subscribe on that good shit all that hot shit it's your boy on tv on the road to 10k subscribers and i'm gone you dig